Pay attention. Creepy weirdo. I would like a strong, powerful woman to protect me. Mm hmm. He'll fight for America. Yep. Who be square? The Playable Characters Podcast. Oh, sorry. <coughs> you want to start with that? I think we should. I think we should. Because you're disgusting, Calvin. Sorry. Welcome to episode 71. Calvin's Flem <laughs> Podcast. <laughs> Flemmable Characters <laughs> Podcast. <laughs> oh my God, starring Calvin's allergies. Ugh, you know, summer. Ugh. I am Brian McGinnis. Across from me. Oh, Patel, to my right. <laughs> Calvin <laughs> Cato. Oh, come on. You're spiking it up. <laughs> That's too much, Turn your mic down. Come on, be professional. I am. I'm trying. Um, guys, hey, the, this weekend, August 11th, Long Island Retro Expo. Get your tickets. Still a couple things left. Uh... Congrats to Mike Hawes, one of our fans who won the free tickets. Yay! Which is awesome. Mike is the best. Yeah, and um, it's going to be very fun. So they have a lot of cool stuff. Not just us. We're doing a live show, though. Our guests are going to be incredible. I can't wait. It's going to be super cool and fun. Top secret. But uh, yeah, come out to that. Check it out if you're in Long Island or anywhere near there. We'll obviously. try to do a live uh, episode recording, and maybe we can put that out. Yes. But, yes. We'll but, but no, then they won't come. Okay, don't come. No, we're not going to do it. We so are, come. We are going to do that. All right. But yeah. All right. All right. Don't tell them. We're great at advertising. <laughs> <laughs> Follow us on Instagram and Twitter, at Playable Podcast. Check out our new video on Instagram TV. It's like a 10-minute video at the Ace Comic Con. 10 minutes? You're crazy. Shut up. It's funny. Well, it's on YouTube. That's the one you put it's it on YouTube. It's on YouTube. YouTube. It's also on Instagram okay. TV. Right. Yep, yes. same thing. Exactly. IGTV. We're trying to get that rolling. IGTV is. Or just literally that company. We're trying to get that rolling. IGTV. We have a 1% ownership of IGTV. We do. So yeah. we get okay. no so money. So please help us out. Yeah. So Patreon is uh, patreon.com slash playable podcast. All that good stuff. You guys know. Rate us. Give us a review on iTunes or wherever or yeah. wherever you listen. Yeah. We are. It helps us out. I always forget the, our tagline. Real funny interviews with real video game characters. That's yes. us. Oh, look at that. And speaking of which, we're going to bring in this next guest. Um, okay. Probably. I mean, economically, he's one of the most important people in <laughs> yeah. video gaming. He's yes. probably say. for one of the most, the biggest game on earth, it seems like right now. Yeah. Or yeah, um, it's been, it's been probably the, the biggest game. It's one of those games that like, oh, we get like 10 million players a fucking second. And it's like, what? Like, it's like, it's like that yeah, crazy. I think there's like a lot of Chinese players. <laughs> probably. Well, that's just impressive. Oh, no, I thought it was like all Korean. No, not in World of Warcraft. It's the same thing to Olop. <laughs> oh, don't put racism in my mouth. Come on. So uh, you guys always put it in my mouth. So anyway, let's bring him in. Well, we're not going to that. <laughs> what are you doing, Olop? <laughs> I, was, I, was, I was saying put it in my mouth very softly. Oh, okay. Uh, we have the auctioneer from the incredibly popular World of Warcraft. Let's yes. bring him in. How you doing, man? Hey, how are you? Doing incredible. Thanks for joining us today. You're welcome. It took me a very long time to get here. How come? Uh, because, you know, it's the world of Warcraft Azeroth is a 24-7 thing, and I only have off for about three hours every Tuesday. And, is that right? <laughs> oh, God. It's a strict it's schedule. Three, it's, it's a really strict schedule. It's a 24-7 business. So yeah. you're the only auctioneer. They don't have another backup auctioneer. There's like one, and then there's a second one. But we both look the same. I have blonde hair. <laughs> he's got brown hair. It's the, we're the same guy, I same gotcha. voice. You, know, mm -hmm. but, you, but, you have the same merch, the same wares. Yeah, yeah. We. Uh, What's your name? Is it just auctioneer? Oh, yeah. or you, it, uh, what should we call it? I, I go auctioneer one. And he's auctioneer A, but I was like, numbers are better, they come first. And oh, of course. That's, that's how that works. <laughs> like so, Universe 1 and Universe A, I get it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, and people come to me first because I'm a little bit more in front of the door. So people run in, they come in on these <laughs> giant creatures, and then the creatures disappear because we do not want any of that in this no, auction right. house. Oh, you don't of, course, want of course. It's like a bull in a china shop scenario. Oh, yeah. You don't want I, that to happen. And you got to see the things that people have. They have like panthers. Yeah. They, they have panthers. They got these gigantic. Like I don't, I don't know. Hippogriffs, I, I, hippogriffs. Yeah, yes. you don't want that hippogriff poop. They got these gigantic mammoths, and yeah. the ma I don't like the mammoths because the mammoths have like another auctioneer on there, so it's like a portable one, and I hate oh. it. Wait, they have auctioneers on the mammoths? That's yeah. how big it is. Yeah, there's a like repairman, so that puts the blacksmith out of, out of business, and it's it's, <laughs> it's terrible. The whole thing. It's, wow. it's the whole thing, and people people spend a lot of a lot of gold on that. Yeah. What? What? Oh man, if I if I could have one of these creatures, I think I would want a panther. I feel like I would want like. Skeletor's panther, something like that. Can they fly? I want a flying steed. Yeah, yeah you know what? Yeah, be, you should get a Pegasus. Pegasus. Can I get a flying panther? There's always flying I mean, ones. There's yeah, there's panthers. There's a uh, panthers made out of stone. And there's stone. Like, there's different ones. There's a 
One that's red. You guys don't have any <laughs> like uh, <laughs> one that's purple. <laughs> like uh, parking lots for mounts, though. I, I, I where do they like Where do they go? Where they, they kind of just disappear, right? It's weird. You know, I'm not allowed outside of the <laughs> place, so I don't see where they come from. But oh, when okay. they come in, it just poofs into smoke. I don't know where they go. It's yeah, a lot weird. of weird magic stuff going on. Wouldn't it be great though if there's no more parking spots when you park somewhere? You just poof it, like your car disappears, and then when you need it, poof, it's there again. I mean, that would be great in New York City, that's for sure. <laughs> Amazing. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, I would never have to worry about parallel parking like ever again. It's shrinks you put in your pocket or something. Yeah. Now, uh, Auk One. Can I call you Auk One? Yeah, yeah. Okay, Auk One. Auk One. I like Auk One. Like near? Yeah, sounds Ox, like okay. it. See, I got a real name now. This guy can suck it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you ever get to, you know, buy any of these items yourself, or you're always just auctioning? Or You know, it's it's weird. These people bring me these amazing pieces of work yeah. and then I don't get to wear them or, or do anything. I You see these overalls. They're terrible. I mean, <laughs> you are wearing I, overalls. I, I wear the, the worst clothing you can, you can get and you know what? Some people just ha- they just sit there and hold on to it for about 48 hours and if no one buys it then I got to give it back to them. It's I would like a nice oh, pair of clothing okay. once mm-hmm. but yeah. no, no. Doesn't there was, somebody ever leave it behind? They just like maybe they say ah, you know they, they, maybe auto, they pay for it they don't come back for it. Probably automatically goes to their into their Inventory. Yeah, they, they have a mailbox. It goes to, right to the mailbox so oh, it's okay. not sold. Mm-hmm. And then we do keep a cut from it too. So it's always, we always make money off of it. It's no, so who that owns the like auction Amazon. house? Amazon. Yeah, who, who it, owns it? It's, it's like kind of Amazon like Amazon. Yeah, yeah, it's like Amazon, except we're more efficient. You don't have to wait two days. You <laughs> get it in like two minutes. <laughs> oh, is there, is there an Amazon somewhere. inside Azeroth? I mean, I know Jeff Bezos is always expanding his business. Uh, <laughs> no, no, no. Yeah, because not, okay. time is a weird continuum in this world. It's way different than the real world. It's strange. Like day and night cycles. So I just so weird. I can spend twenty minutes in one place, and then and, you know it's daytime. Then it becomes nighttime. So how do you like it here with the twenty-four hour cycle? Oh, I hate it. You hate it. <laughs> I hate it. The faster. I hate it. <laughs> uh, you know, it's, it's very strange to me. Yeah. How old are you, Ock One? Uh, if, if we go by my, my physical age, I'm about 46, but if okay. we go by Blizzard age, I'm like 12. Oh, okay. so oh, right. It's <laughs> weird. I don't know if you're like 4,000 years old according to your time or something. Oh, like no, no. I wasn't sure if it was like that. Okay, it's not that much. No, difference. we don't really get that much focus. It's all about the king, the first king who died in, in battle. Then, you know, his son took reign, and then there's another king who died in battle, and his son took... And it just keeps on going like that for like, I don't know, like 4,000 years. I would hate to be... I mean, you, you, if you're a king, you know you're going to die. In battle, probably. It's, well, it must but be if rough. you're Most kings a don't person, die you know you're going to die. So. Yeah, but you know you're going to die in battle, like getting stabbed through the face with a spear or something. I yeah, my my job is pretty secure. No spears. No. Yeah. I just hold them, and right. I'm like, oh, this is pretty cool, and then uh, I have to put them in the, in the pile. And, and so, you don't have to worry about any like orc invasions or anything? Oh, no. See, like they have are their own Are you in Ironforge? Town. Which city are you looking? I'm in Stormwind. Oh, you're in Stormwind. So I'm, looking looking I'm in Stormwind, yeah. yeah. Uh, actually, if you go there right now and you talk to Auction Year One, it's not going to respond to you because it's not me. So, <laughs> <laughs> Well, because the time continuum is also different, right? So if it take me a while to get into Azeroth... Uh, it, it depends on when you log out. So if you if you log <laughs> out in, in Stormwind, it, takes, it actually takes significantly Well, I have to log out of reality to log into... No, no, Azeroth. you need reality. Oh, you need reality. See, okay. the odd thing about being an auctioneer is that you unfortunately <laughs> hear the terrible things about this reality. Like, everyone talks about the music, and when someone's like, I like this band, they have someone else that comes up and they go, no, your band sucks. Yeah. You must listen to my music. And I'm like, I don't like any of these people. <laughs> yeah, music like, in the real world is actually pretty terrible right now. Oh, it's, yeah. it's awful. Yeah. I, I heard some stuff here. Uh, that I, I don't know what it is. Have Cardi- you heard of Cardi B? It's Cardi pretty B. bad. Yeah. <laughs> hey, I, I Cardi confused B is it with- a self-made woman. Stop it. <laughs> Just stop. I, I was shown some videos of Cardi B doing Star Wars sounds, and that was quite entertaining <laughs> to me. Is that a real thing? Yeah. I'll have to watch that it, later. it is. My goodness. I bet it's the worst thing on YouTube, probably. The, the person in my Uber was thing. like telling me about the show and playing the video. I was like, wow, that is, that is quite entertaining. Wow. Also, what is this Uber? This is you, yeah, I was like, how do you have an Uber account? <laughs> it's, 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 you know, it's, it's, I find it very necessary in a busy city like New York, yeah. I have to say. You couldn't take a mammoth around New York City. Oh, you can't, yeah, you yeah. can't even fly, hello. I mean, yeah. you, you, yeah. I'm still stuck on Cardi B Star Wars sounds. It's so funny. <laughs> you should listen to it. Oh well, you shouldn't, but you should. It's, 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 it's ridiculous. a Wookie with it a Dominican accent. <laughs> oh jeez, it's like skrrt. Like she's like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I think I did hear that actually yeah. on something. Yeah, that's what she does. Oh, Cardi B just. Geez. I just love how Cardi. That's like her comma now. She it's really, like, so you know, I'm just sitting here and skrrt, and it's like, like it's she's 
great at it. She it's sounds nice. like a robot, like one of the things that programmed me. It's yeah. weird. <laughs> <laughs> so what's uh what's some of the cool stuff that comes into your is it a shop, I guess we can say, or your Well location? it's it, yeah. well we actually were in like the side of a building and then mm. we upgraded when uh, the whole world was lit on fire. It was great. This it, dragon came by and like ruined everything. Is that right? Yeah. I'm not too familiar yeah. with, with with that world. His, his name was Deathwing. Well and, uh, yeah, you know obviously I, I, I heard heard about mean, that. I heard he did his that. he did his job. Yeah, he did his job and then I got an upgrade out of that. So I wasn't too upset and other people you know they got more gear it's really weird what happens is every two years something terrible happens <laughs> and then people will come to me and be like hey um can you sell this for me and i'm like yeah i, I guess it's kind of my job yeah so then i'll i'll put it in the auction house and some uh, some people will try to buy it or they will let it sit there for 48 hours and then it's great because some people they'll bring like materials to make things mm-hmm. and that's very high a lot of people want that and okay. one person will buy them all and then put them up for more. Oh. And then it's it's amazing. I just sit there. I'm like, you are screwed. <laughs> <laughs> Capitalism, right? Yeah. And then one guy comes over and he puts more up for cheaper. And then he wins. And it's amazing. Because huh. it's, yeah. The only auction type thing I do is on like when I did like FIFA or Madden. You can like, you know, you, when you're building your ultimate team and you can put like certain players on the auction block. And my friend was telling me he spent hours a day on this fucking thing. Like buying like Lionel Messi and Ronaldo for like three hundred thousand oh virtual god. coins. And oh my god! Some people are just like fifty coins, but it's just like yeah, it seems too much for me. But I I can see with by like materials and swords and mm-hmm. things like that 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 seems to make sense. Are you well, like a traditional like uh, cattle rancher style auctioneer? Like one hey, one time, hey, can I get a fire? Can I get a I, I, I try to do that, but there's so many people that it, I kind of talked over myself for okay. quite some time. And they probably have weird was, screen names too, so they're not easy to. Oh say my god, I, I have a, I have a couple of my favorites right here. Oh okay, yeah. Oh, nice. uh, I learned about politics from a man named Panda Slayer. I mean, that was okay. Who would uh, would name this a panda slayer? Someone who hates endangered species. What what, what happened was, there is pandas in the game. They came out uh, a couple years after. Oh, there's pandas in there? Oh, there's there's panda people? See, Calvin? Yeah. Are they allowed to fuck, or do they need porn? Like the <laughs> it's very it's a very strange thing. Speaking of reality, <laughs> know, and they're they're too big; they barely fit in the place. I don't know how it happens, but then that's where the uh, all the cool crystallized uh, mounts come from, and people love those. That? People love those things. Okay, yeah. Uh, then I learned a little bit about music, and uh, apparently this uh, marijuana from. Uh, X X Morning Lights four twenty X X. I don't know what the X's are. People still do the X X thing. That's, oh, that's constantly. amazing! <laughs> constantly. <laughs> that was so fun in like the AOL chat. Would you like to tr- try some marijuana, Aquan? I, I, mean, I, I I if you have, I don't know what it's. Well, like. we could talk about that offline. We could. Yeah, yeah. 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 You, you told Narkman that you know. Oh yeah, that's right. That's not really you. At all. Uh, this is it's a character I'm doing right now. Right now, it's a character. It's a character. Oh, oh, oh this is a character. I can't tell. Uh-huh. Playable Al podcast. <laughs> Smokable characters podcast. <laughs> so you don't have any drugs. You have alcohol. Oh, it tons of alcohol. Okay. <laughs> tons of alcohol. There's dwarven ales. If you go to the bar, you can buy some of that, and you drink. And apparently, the screen gets all fuzzy for people. It's yeah. amazing. <laughs> so right away, dwarven ale sounds like I don't like beer. I think it's gross. It's sa- it's sa- I feel like it would taste disgusting, but it would do the job really fast. It I does. Feel like dwarven ale would, like probably be like a really good forty. You know, like oh, like a king like. cobra ish, but like mm-hmm. you know, like just a little bit more distilled. Oh, it's it's gigantic. There's these barrels that are, are yeah. gigantic. They're huge, and they run throughout the entire city of Stormwind, especially in the Dwarven District, where you'll find a couple of other blacksmiths just standing there forever. At least I get to do something. They just stand there. It's <laughs> yeah. awful. Wow. Yeah. So, and so um, what led you to the auctioneering path? You know? Well, I, I was really good at holding things, and I was like, <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, and someone was like, can you hold on to this for two days for me? And I'm like, yes, I can. And then I'm like, I can hold on to it for one day, two days, maybe 12 hours. It's up to you. I yeah. can hold on to it. And then when they're like, I want it back, I'm like, Okay, but I still want some money, and right. they, they give it to me. It's, I fell right into the career. Where do you get that discipline to just stand there and hold something? Yeah, uh, just you know, when you do it every day, you just kind of forget where you, you, you learned it from. It's just sure. it's a natural thing. I yeah. mean, there's a couple of people who I've seen people run around, and they're they're not actually played by anyone. They, I, I try to talk to them, and uh, they they don't say anything. They just go on their merry way, and I'm like, okay, the Chinese <laughs> bots. They're Chinese bots. That that's what I hear. Yeah. I hear a lot of this stuff going on, and you can tell because they're always naked. It's weird. <laughs> Is that true? Yeah. 
They don't wear the armor. They just uh, uh, they're just farming yeah. gold. Yeah, and stuff. like stuff. level one characters. You can tell because when they run into the the room naked, you're like up. Oh, there's one of them. You guys don't have like a no shirt, no shoes uh, kind of policy in the <laughs> no, uh, it, no mammoths. Yeah. Yeah. Just no mammoths. No, no mammoths. Okay. You can be straight up naked. We don't care as long as you're giving us stuff or, or not. That's it's a cool a, place. That's very posi- body positive. Yeah. I like that. Yeah, we don't shame here, especially when everyone's in shape. It's amazing. <laughs> Except the pandas. Yeah, the pandas are the only rolly <laughs> ones. And those damn orcs. Yeah. yeah. Have you ever yeah. thought of working for the uh, the horde? Has, like, you know, I know I know you don't have a lot of job opportunities because there's only so many auction houses. But you ever think of jumping over, maybe getting a promotion, getting a raise, working for the horde? Who's the horde? Of, well, the alliance is the humans and elves, okay. uh, and you know other races, and then it's the. I just know Hordak. The Horde is or, the orcs and the Torrens and gotcha. yeah, it's it's really weird because for a while everyone hated each other and now all of a sudden they were getting together and everyone was having fun fighting this Lich King and that was great and all mm. and then everyone started fighting it and now we're we're fighting again soon. You guys yeah. took care of the oh. Lich King already? Oh yeah, well he's dead. There's well there's a new Lich King apparently. Oh, he see, whispers see? to people. Kings always die. I'm there's there's tons you. of kings and they're all dead. So <laughs> it's 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 not a good profession. Well, especially especially with the from the news from the horde. Apparently, they had one leader who who died, and then they replaced him with someone else who was a uh, uh, he did some crimes against humanity, so to speak. Where even the the horde was like, "Hey, that's that's wrong. We should get rid of him." Oh, wow! Yeah, and they were like, so now uh, they replaced him with this one guy who was a a literal troll. He's he's not like one of those people who yell yeah, at like me. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, like, a, yeah. Like, like a troll. Like, like an physical, actual like a troll. Physical, physical, okay. big, troll. ugly troll. Yeah, I yeah, gotcha. yeah. And, uh, That's so a stereotype. Not all trolls are ugly. Bro. No, no, no. I think they are. Uh, They're all ugly. That's racism again. On your yeah, it's not racism. Yeah. It's trollism. It's troll is a race. Fa- it's literally trolling. You're trolling trolls right now. Facism? Yeah. Is it facism? They're no, they're a race. They're well, a race. They're, they're, they're a race. race. They're, they're, they're very hunched over, and people are like, we don't like the hunched over stuff. So now there's even more trolls coming in. And this is... Every so often we find this new piece of land that just, you know, and that has some sort of troll on it. And we're like, okay, well, you, you don't like them either? Okay, fine. We'll go, go to another one. And, and <laughs> Trolls seems to be the default uh, first race of things anywhere. There's a lot of trolls in this, in this mystical world. Huh? I think there's a lot of trolls and a lot of orcs. Yeah. Lots of trolls, orcs. And uh, because they're, they're known for eating people's faces, I try to stay on this side. Yeah, that's yeah, not, yeah, I don't yeah, think I'll fair. be accepted over there. Well, you're pretty safe, I guess, in Stormwind, right? There's never really any... I mean, except for the dragon burning it down. But well, from the dragon burning uh, everything down, um, I'm pretty safe in my nice little marble area. And also, I have like probably about 500 people in front of me at all times, so oh, wow. I'm pretty good. I stand on a pedestal, and it's the only time I'm above them all. It's great. That's, that's, that seems fun. So, what was like the coolest th- uh, weapon or something someone brought into you, or, or, or most expensive one even? Oh well, right now the most expensive one is uh, is actually a mount. From uh, one of the, one of the things I can't remember what's on. I think it's from a trading card pack. What kind of mount is it? For like a me- like a like a saddle? You mean like a mount like that? Well, mounts in this world are like the creatures that people can sit on, it's, ah. and that's what they. That's they the use pandas, to travel. not yeah. the pandas. Sorry, the, pan- the panthers and stuff like that. That's yeah, a mount. Don't sit on pandas. Yeah. All. yeah. Yeah. Right. The, well, I, you could sit on a panda. I don't care. Nice and fluffy. So why, why is it so expensive, this mount? Uh, because it's super rare. Some people uh, put things up for a very, very uh, a lot of gold. Mm-hmm. And, but now the whole economy is messed up because now apparently you can buy this coin with real world money. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> and then you can use that for gold or you can buy more time because apparently life is finite in this world. So <laughs> Okay. It's a lot of rules. Oh, yeah. there's, there's Life plenty. is finite in this world, yeah. Yeah. It is. Oh, it's yeah. it's well, you know, in this world, I can I know I'll at least live a day. In this world, people don't know if they're going to last a month. It's, yeah. it's amazing, especially yeah. if you're a king. Oh yeah. There's no respawns in this world. We just straight up. Well, actually, um, interesting fact: when in this world, in, the, in in Azeroth, if you die, you go back to the graveyard and you got to go back to your body, and then you come back alive. But everything's just destroyed more, so you got to spend more money to fix it. Can you imagine <sighs> dying then going back and finding your dead body? I could, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Of course he could. Well, I, I heard Dark tongue. motherfucker. Oh, there's so many stories. It's all the weed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. My body's just chilling. <laughs> Aqua One, it seems like there's so many... Uh, it's such a big economy in Azeroth, right? There's a lot of people like you who don't even fight. They're just like, the you know, the blacksmiths or they're yeah. auctioneers or... You know, it's uh, what do you guys do like on an off hours? You guys go hang out somewhere. We, say it's like we, three, hours we, we have three hours off a week. So yeah. usually when it happens, sometimes it's more based upon like what's happening in this real world. You know. So when do you see your wife and stuff like that? Are you married? I I am married. Okay. I have I have four kids. Well, he has maybe. a ring. Oh, wow. so yeah. Yeah, okay. I have I have four kids. 
uh, and I they say I, I come in home like daddy you're home I'm like yes I am now I have to go and they <laughs> see me for another week I think he'd probably nap when he take guesses break that's what I would do would you want your kids to go into auctioneering uh, yes yeah, so I don't have to see him that much <laughs> wow <laughs> makes sense <laughs> pretty sure pretty sure uh, better there right. I, I've been training them the ways of the auctioneer I say <laughs> say you're number one and two and three really quick and then, you know they <laughs> All but right. I only got like a half hour to do that, so you know. Oh, yeah, yeah. Then I got to spend my other hour. I gotta go. I gotta go work out. I gotta train. I gotta go to the gym. Yeah, everyone's fit. And he's got to do his standing yeah. exercises. So, is uh, your wife a stay-at-home mom or? Oh, I I hope so. I, I <laughs> you don't know. You're only there for three <laughs> hours. <laughs> three hours. So. <laughs> Who knows? She's, <laughs> she's like hello, and I'm like hello, and I'm like goodbye. So, well, goodbye. how much time do you guys get together? You know what I'm saying? Like with quotation probably marks. just four times. Yeah. Just four kids. Yeah. <laughs> That's just those only four times. Okay. <laughs> What's well, weird? We only got together like three times, but I don't know. Oh, oh. Is oh. Is one of your kids part panda? No, no, not as far <laughs> as I know. I mean, I haven't seen him in a week, so you know, <laughs> I decided. To, I I told the wife that I was super busy, and I didn't tell her I was coming here. What are your I kids' guess. names? I, I I don't know. I okay. let the wife you deal with that. Let her deal with that. I let her portion. deal with that. I don't have time. So you how just you go. Your, how did you and your wife meet? Uh, well, she came in and she's like, oh, wow, that looks good. I'm like, marry me. And then uh, <laughs> we had to take her from there. And oh. then you're just like, all right, I got to go work. I'll see you later. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. We, we went on a date at my job. You know, someone brought in some wheat and some other stuff. You guys don't have like labor. You, you should have like 40 hour work weeks. This is like a <laughs> he lot seems of. seems happy, but I see what you're saying. You know what I mean? You know. it, it is a terrible thing. I have to say, <laughs> I, I do not get paid that much. Mm-hmm. I mean, um, you know, you only make about a silver and a couple of copper pieces at the end of the day. Yeah. Is that no. not a lot? No, no. There's people out there who make tons of gold. There's these uh, these rogues, these thieves that go around. And what they do is that they, they just steal things from people. Oh. They go back to a guy, they make like 25,000 gold. I'm like, this is, this is, I should be doing that too. I feel like if I played this game, that's what I would do. I, would, I, I wouldn't bother with the auction house. I'd probably just want to be a thief. Yeah. I can't believe you were saying that right in front of him. Well, did, 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 did that hurt you? Did that hurt your job, I guess? No, not really no, because... No. They spend it at me anyway because they got to buy the, yeah, the they super get, rare they, stuff. They see? Eventually, you got to go back to the auction house, Always right? it goes back to him. Yeah, yeah. All roads lead to the auctioneer. Yeah, it does. It does. We, there's actual uh, other bots and stuff and programs. People make characters just to sit at the auction house. It's, it's, it's amazing. Yeah. Have you ever thought of doing uh, like a restaurant auction house combo? Because if people are going to be spending a lot of time at the auction house anyway... They could be eating. Hey, get a burger while you're here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I, I agree with that. I tried to pitch that idea to the King Stormwind, and unfortunately he died. So then I, <laughs> so you know, right. I had to start from the beginning So you have to re-pitch yeah. it to the yeah, yeah. And they were too busy like mourning the loss of the one king. I mean, you're it's like, not well, like there was eight million before them. Yeah, you know? right. And you're like, but wait, I have this cool burger idea. Yeah, and they're like, they're like, we're still, it's been two years. It's been <laughs> yeah. two years, get and they're still it. like, you know, can you can you give us some time? And I'm like, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, get I, over it, right? I can't believe that. Move on, yeah. What's... um. What's like the worst thing someone's ever brought to you? Like, hey man, can I, can I get like five dollars for this? Like, this, oh, like, oh, there's there's a man who uh, he started uh, started crafting and he brought me these white plain shirts and he's like. <laughs> He put them up for 250 gold a piece. And I'm like, you, you're not going to get anything from oh, them. Oh, white tees? Like white that t-shirts. Song? Yeah, yeah. yeah. All white tees? Like 250 white gold, yeah. He thought he was the uh, Kanye West of uh, Azeroth. And then oh, okay. he went into this thing called Trade, tra- tra- uh, trade Chat where he was pitching the shirts and no one was buying it. Oh. People were calling him awful things. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yeah, yeah. Were you, did, did, did you go through a long black tea phase, Calvin? A long black tea phase? No, I did not. Oh, you're good. Huh? Okay, I'm just wondering. Yeah. We sell That's those racist. too. No, it's a, come on, it, was, it, was, it was very big in the urban community a couple, a couple of years ago. I think down to like your ankle. Remember a couple of years ago, that was like maybe like 2000 or something. Eh, That's a long time ago. Oh, five, oh six, oh seven. I'm guessing. No, there were not huge I think white so. teeth like that. Oh, no. did you go through a long white tea phase? No, I don't do stuff like that. Brian, did you go through a long white tea phase? All my shoes are so long because I'm tall. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> not on purpose. Alk one. Uh, uh, what so is there something that you've been like? Hey, we can't sell that. Like, oh, good question. Like, this is like, mm. have people tried to sell or things you illegally t- or will oh. you take anything? Well, we can't just take every, anything. I mean, there's some people that meet up in uh, a town outside the Stormwind called Goldshire, and they sell some things there. It's it's not. We I don't I don't dabble in this, but uh, sometimes it is a. Uh, when they when the people get naked there and they have their own little conversations and stuff and I'm like to get that out of here they can't have that in like the naked they sell naked conversations they sell like <laughs> they talk and they uh, apparently they have a what they call a 
online sex oh, in the game. Oh, interesting. Yeah. yeah, very strange because, I, I mean, you could do it in person. I, I know the concept <laughs> of real life now. It's <laughs> right. You know, it's, it's, it just looks better, I, I feel. <laughs> yeah. Have you and your wife ever taken a vacation to the real world to do like, you know, you know, I, I should have brought her. I should have brought, yeah. brought her, but I, I couldn't because she has to watch the four kids. Yeah, so, right. You know, yeah. Can't bring Maybe all that. you don't no. know. No. <laughs> and I, I'm afraid if she likes the real world better, I mean, then we're going to have no one for our kids. It's going to be strange. Then I actually have to, you know, stop doing this. Yeah, well, think, maybe your kids want to like live in the real world. Have they ever like? Express interest in doing that or something? Well, in the five minute conversations I've had with them, I, I <laughs> it's, know, it, it's, it's more like, tough. "Where are? Why are you leaving, Daddy?" And then like, that's that's it. And yeah. probably like, I don't think auctioneering is a big job here in this world. He'd have to really work like. Oh, a do you have Christie's well, the, Christie's he, auction house? Yeah, but that's like you no, know, that's a different kind of auctioneering. Yeah, yeah. Like, you would be. He would no, be, you could do well, that. Well, He's got to work at like a dollar store. No, well, well I've, heard, heard, I've heard of this at uh, first because they have they have tons of wares and supplies, and he'd be like. You know what I mean? And then work his way up, I think. To the, to but the he's big, great well, at holding things. So well, I've, have to be a thing. I've also heard of this electronic bay of sorts. Yeah, oh, yes, um, yes, yes. You know, I, that was Similar an, idea. an online auction house where mm-hmm. people sold, uh, although for some reason it looks like crap that's sold for way more <laughs> than it's worth, Sometimes, I have to say. Yeah. yeah. I sell a lot of crap. On and it doesn't have a nice theory. human touch like you. You know, I'd rather go, instead of going to eBay, I would rather go to, to you know, like electronic yeah. bay. I would rather go and have some, you know, a person like you. Yeah, and the strange thing is, yeah, no one wants gold here. It's very strange, especially when you can only use it in one place and it's not here. So yeah. it's, you it's know. Weird. Gold, gold doesn't weird. have the same. I'll take, do you have gold? I, I'll take some gold. <laughs> I got some gold, but you can't, you can't use it in this place. People Are you sure? I have, I have cash. I oh, what is that? Cash. Is that, is that a, what is that? This is a place where I store my current, my, my real world money. You can do that? People Dude. just. Olive has mm-hmm. four real dollars. Oh my yeah. God. <laughs> How much can I get? <laughs> do we have to do this auction style, or can you just sell me gold? Well, there's two ways to do it. First, okay, you got to talk go. to the Koreans, and you can turn that money into gold, or you can buy one of these uh, coins that sells on the auction house for like okay. a bunch of money. Oh, so I have to buy a coin, and then I can yeah. use the coin to buy the gold. Wait, yeah. wait, do the Koreans have the golden touch? I guess they do. <laughs> they touch the gold and the gold? Chinese, and they the, what they do is they they. they that's why that's why Trump's so mad at them. He wants that golden touch. <laughs> See, we just figured it out. I didn't know. That. I just heard about that man. Oh, from, he's terrible. Uh, oh, yeah. I've heard terrible things about him online. And he's kind of like our Lich King. It, yeah. Oh my God! <laughs> yes, yes. Except he won't that. die. Terry. But who has better he really hair? He won't. Yeah, we shouldn't say that. The Lich King has better <laughs> hair. It's like as if the Lich King took over and became the king of of, of the Alliance or like oh, Stormwind. You know what I mean? Ev- everyone's zombies underneath him. It's strange. Yes, yeah. yeah. it's pretty bad. <laughs> I, I've learned a lot about that from a man named Obama Rama. So <laughs> <laughs> I heard a rumor. <laughs> The Lich King sounds like an evil name. I like that name, the Lich King. Yeah, it's yeah. a perfect name for an evil king. Well, he used well, to, he used to be a nice person. He was a yeah. good guy. Yeah, he but was then a he good went guy. all Lich on us. Yeah, so. he, he not was like one. our Lich King. Our no. Lich King was never a good guy. <laughs> no, no, not from what I heard. This man used to be a paladin, and then he uh, he turned evil. It was Arthas, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, king, it was uh, king, not King Arthas, Prince, right? Prince Arthas. Yeah, he was. Like, he Prince Arthas. He uh, yeah. killed an entire town. All reads his books. I know. How many? Um, how many? I like guess it races or classes of characters are there? Oh, world? there's well hundreds. Of, first, like, right? we started with like five races: Puerto Ricans, <laughs> uh, blacks, whites, the, uh, the golden Chinese, Chinese, golden Chinese, Japanese, dirty knees. Look at these. <laughs> oh man! Oh really? What? Oh my god! What's wrong with that? That's I mean, well, that's a Family Guy joke, literally. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, we, this is way before Family like, Guy. Fit, like, when I was five years old. Yeah. I've heard of I, this I've Family Guy. I've only heard that joke on Family Guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, you don't have to watch I, Family Guy. I've heard about this Family Guy. He doesn't sound so family-like. No, he really is not. He sounds like no, you, though, like, a little bit. I, I hear that. You sound like Brian the dog, <laughs> in a good way. Yeah. Yeah. Talking dog's not the first time I've seen that. <laughs> What a fun so, world that would be to live in. Um, so, um, do, would you want to spend more time with your family? Like, have you ever thought about, like, you know, maybe being a merchant in another game? Like, say, being a merchant in, like, Zelda World or, like, in. You know, oh, yeah, we had, well, uh, we had Beetle on uh, yeah. a few months ago. The mm-hmm. merchant and Beetle from Zelda. They, 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 they sell things. Yeah. yeah I, I've looked into worlds like. Uh, the, uh, one of the people I look up to is that uh, the shady character in this game called Resident Evil 4. Oh, and, yes, uh, yes, yes. He's always like, what are you buying and what are you selling? I'm like, I like that. I want to use that. But they won't let me say it. Oh, uh, copyright. Re- copyright. Oh, okay. Yeah. Maybe you can think of your own phrase, like the way your own twist on that. Yeah. Like, what do you got? Maybe something like simple as that. I, I was thinking of like, give me your fingernails and stuff like that. But I don't <laughs> give know. me your fingernails. I don't know about that one. That might be like, I, like I, I'm workshopping things. That's yes, a, it's very strange. It's a bit what aggro. Else, what, other, what other catchphrases do you have? <laughs> I'll catch people off guard, I think. <laughs> give me your knives. And, uh, it's mostly give me your give things. Give me your what? Yeah. what yeah, or, okay. or like, take the burlap sack. And then like, thing, you know, I just... <laughs> Like I, I try to sell things as much as I can. Yeah. You can only sell to the people who want them. Do you have anything yeah. for sale right
Well, I need to like so I I have a uh, problem with my hand. If you have you have any kind of gauntlet, like not an infinity gauntlet, obviously, but do you have an infinity gauntlet? No, no. Okay, no. <laughs> Someone else know. has that. It's, uh, if you had some kind of cloak that would make me float in the air, or like a gauntlet, you should you should talk to the mages because they're uh, presumptuous assholes, and uh, <laughs> you should talk to them. They got all sorts of flying stuff. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> just like I don't, I don't want to fly per se. I just want to hover above the ground a little bit. Like, yeah, yeah. You know, actually, like, uh, just ask Chris Angel how to do it. He does that. He's well, a magician. He won't tell. Well, me. there's some uh, there's some <laughs> professions that will help you make uh, things. Like there's some people who actually make things and they sell it. For example, a uh, a flying carpet. People make that. Oh, that no, I feel like that's yeah. a racial <laughs> comment towards <laughs> yeah. me. If you uh, did that though, that that'd be pretty. That would be like taking the N word back, kind of. No, like, I'm taking the not, flying carpet that is back. Not even close. It would be to no. taking the N word back. Not. Too They're in timeout. <laughs> <laughs> Not too different than that. You're like, yo, I'm a badass man. He's taking the flying carpet back. And I respect the hell out of it. I'm not Persian. <laughs> also, the N word isn't magical. <laughs> it is I mean, of, I hear that word. Yeah. I hear that word pretty often in the trade chat. <laughs> it's it's say, very... You hear it a lot in World of Warcraft. It's in a lot of text boxes. But oh, uh, it does not grant flight powers. <laughs> Which is crazy because there's no black people in Azeroth, really, right? Well, no, you, can, can, you can do that, but for some reason, everyone's super white. <laughs> 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 It's like the first default uh, shade of skin. <laughs> yeah. I guess it's the white one. Okay. Yeah. Well, because you know, there's so many different other things you can be. I mean, why would you just be? A, you're you're humans. Why be yeah. a human? You'd be a mystical creature. I guess. Exactly. Yeah. Why I'm not? Tell you, man, take that flying carpet back. Why not be one of those <laughs> lame ass pandas? I mean, I, I are they really know. lame? I think it'd be cool to be a panda. Is, yeah. that, is it? A, is there a kung fu panda? Well, there is. There's They're kind a, of yeah. Well, there's there's <laughs> races and there's classes, and one of these classes are is the monk and yeah. uh, mm-hmm. some pandas. Oh, I've seen. I think I've seen. Okay, yeah, yeah. They're quite annoying. I like rolling and hitting things and I can't I can't have them in here. Could you but be a monk though, so Calvin? I mean Could you be quiet? <laughs> and, could, and could you just be like peaceful? Like add peace. I can be I can be I don't know if you could be I at peace be, with yourself. You're so angry on Facebook. I could you be <laughs> could you be at peace? And be I a could monk? be at peace. I yeah? was at peace before Facebook was on the thing. <laughs> okay, that was a long time. I could ago. be at peace. Okay, you've been, angry, part, you've been angry for fourteen years. Calvin, <laughs> Calvin who's too scared to use uh, Google Calendar for <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> But we'll put all his shit out on Facebook. <laughs> That's true. I mean, I'll be quite honest with you. You don't have to be peaceful to be a monk in this world. They oh, okay. Everyone's super angry about things. I just think monks are pretty, well, at least uh, in World of Warcraft and a lot of the other worlds I visited, I mean, monks are usually pretty violent. Like Wu-Tang oh, Shaolin monks. Yes. Right? Yeah. I mean, yeah. Kung Lao? There you go. Yeah. Aqua, one, one final question here. Yeah. All right. Well, maybe not final question. We got to go. So, yeah, yeah. yeah. But, uh, they're going to go. They're gonna have go you one. ever thought... You know what? I want to get. I want to put on this piece of armor. I want to go adventuring myself. I'm done with this auctioning. Let me get out there. And, you know, like could you just buy it and be like, I'm done. I'm going to explore. I tried that. Uh, and, uh, odd thing is that once I got to the door, everything turned black on me. It was so oh, strange. Wow. And I was right back at the podium. It was very. <laughs> very uh, he's kind of like he's wow. kind of like uh, yeah. indebted to be there for mm-hmm. for life. Yeah, it, it, I I tried to break out of. But once again, that that every Tuesday, I get <laughs> a little again, bit of time. A lunch break. <laughs> a little bit of time. Labor unions in Azeroth. Yeah, so you can have, so you can leave your place of work for more than three hours. You got to swoop in on your flying carpet and. and, and, and I will. Up. Maybe I'll start a labor revolution. In can Azeroth. you? Can you show me the world? <laughs> oh man, Ak One, <laughs> do it. Ak One coming at me with jokes, shine and shimmer I I only say these because these are the words I've learned from others, <laughs> <laughs> from, one of, from one of the many conversations that you've had. Uh, we got to go. Anything else you want to tell us, Ak One? Anything else? Do you, you want to you know tell the fans or the world or anything? book a zine? Uh, uh, a, a you got a zine, zine coming out. Uh, <laughs> An auctioneers <laughs> conference, whatever. There's a there is auction con. Oh, is and, you know, it? Of course, there is. Aux con. Aux con. Okay. Yeah, aux con. Aux con. Aux con. That's coming. That's in uh, some other place. So. You gotta go to podcast on. Thon. Con. Pod. 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 I'm sure there is. Pod con. I'm sure it's a pod con. Yeah. But th- there is a, another podcast that I hear about called Copper Piece, which all of this stuff about Dungeons and Dragons. Oh, and, oh. check it out. And this is pretty much where Azeroth is based off of very loosely. <laughs> so, oh, interesting. It's very interesting. Yes. Very loosely. Very very loosely stolen. You know, <laughs> I, I can't say some things, but they can just straight up copy, and it's okay. <laughs> and, you know. Hey, do you want to play a quick game of those before we head out of here? Sure. Let's play a quick game. Wed, bed, dead, everybody. Yay! Uh, bed, dead. So, uh, Ark, we're going to give you three Off. video game characters. Tell us who you want to wed, who you want to bed, and who you want dead. So as long as we don't tell my wife. No, we won't. Oh, definitely. don't worry. Or my five kids. So, we got... We got you have another one? There's... Oh, sorry. Since the last time? <laughs> <laughs> I, probably, I probably have five by now. Who knows? <laughs> 
All right, so we got three characters here, all very different. Uh, this, this, this is going to be good. So the first one is from F -f 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 Final Fantasy VI. There's so many Final Fantasy characters. Yeah. Who do you know from Final Fantasy VI? Uh, I forget. I don't know anybody from Final Fantasy Cecil, Salas. It's going to be Edgar. Oh. oh. So uh, explain Edgar. Calvin just think he's got a blue. Uh, he is a bit of a dandy. He looks. Uh, I was gonna say he looks. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna use a different word, but is this so, better? Is this even more dandy? Yeah. Oh my he god! Totally that's a dandy. So he's got like a blue fancy cloak, yes. and he's got a long blonde, beautiful blonde hair. Some yes. of the mages look like that. I swear. Yeah, yeah. I know, he's a bit yeah. foppish. Yes, he's <laughs> foppish and fair, foppish and fair haired. He is one of the heroes. A lot of frottage going on here. No frottage. Okay. He is very not frottage. He is. He likes the women. He's a very much. A womanizer. Okay, womanizer. Uh, oh, a sword. As most of the people in the game are. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So he's got a sword. And his main his main thing is he creates his own tools. So like that's a special thing. So he has an automatic crossbow. What do you mean? Like that's those are his weapons. He makes like auto. It's an auto crossbow. You never use an auto crossbow before. Yeah. No, like he makes it out of nowhere. Like he or he likes like he's an inventor or whatever. Yeah, he's an inventor. Okay, no, I thought he like snap his fingers and boom, here's a machine gun. No, it's not like with the mammoths. It's like he actually okay. makes it. So he has that. He has a chainsaw. He has like a. Um, so he's handy. Yes, he's very handy. Okay, that's good. And handsy. Is he so. a good guy or a bad guy? No, he's a good guy. Good he's guy. He's a good guy. He's just kind of a he's pervert. Handy and dandy. <laughs> Give it yeah. up. Give it up. Give it up. Gotcha. All right. Yes. I've Sorry, never guys. had a high five before. <laughs> it's pretty good, right? It's pretty good, Hawk. All right. Uh, this next one is from uh, one of the best games ever that's coming back out soon. Uh, Wed Sorry, Red Dead Redemption. Oh. <laughs> Red Dead. Uh, Bonnie McFarlane. Oh. So Bonnie works on the farm. She works on the ranch. She's a stand-up comedian, right? <laughs> She's not not, oh. the, not the comic Bonnie. Oh, okay. All right. But yeah, so she, uh, she started off as a good girl. She kind of became a badass. You know, she got the gun. She works on, on the again, the, the farm. She helped out John, right? Mm -hmm. they kind of like, she yeah, related to Seth? Times. She taught John how to wrangle um, animals and shit. Yeah, there you go. So Bonnie, She's a rancher's daughter. Yes. She is a hardcore... Cattle rancher. Yeah. Oh, so she's probably a little dirty because she lives in a barn. And she's just... But she looks like she can make a lot of money. She's handy, yeah. too. So. <laughs> she's handy, too, I guess, in a way. She's kind of like Dolores from uh, uh, Westworld. Westworld, but not as like crazy and homicidal and stuff. That's and not, not a robot. Yeah. That's not bad. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so We don't know that. And this one, Calvin. Akuma. Akuma. Oh. From Calvin, explain to Street us Fighter. what Akuma is. The angriest man in video games, I feel like. Yes. <laughs> right. Literally, his hair is like on fire. <laughs> yep. Um, you know, uh, he is a fighter. He's very dedicated to He's being a redheaded karate master. He is awfully he's ripped. Not, he is <laughs> ripped to shreds. Is he a redneck? A redheaded. Dude. Oh, he's a redneck karate master. He looks like a demon or something. Yeah, he, he, do, he looks like one, although he's not a demon. He's not actually he's a demon? Not, no, he's not, okay. he's, not into, he's not evil. He just is very into fighting. I, he seems evil, I don't evil, know if man. I believe he's that. Some of his catchphrases, like when you, when, you, when you win, he's just like, I will murder you a thousand times more, or something like that. Like that's he what, says, but Kobe would say stuff like that. Kobe too. Bryant, yeah. Well, he, yeah. Well, <laughs> I've heard him say he's that. Very competitive, <laughs> very competitive fighter. <laughs> I guess he's got, he's got the same moves as Ryu and Ken, yeah, basically, but deadlier. Yeah, fire. He's got like fire fireballs. Yeah, yeah doesn't so. he do like diagonal shit and stuff? Yeah, yeah he jumps in the air and gives diagonal using fireballs. Him in the 30th anniversary yeah. collection, he's good. He's fun. Oh, he's good. good. Okay, he, he's, so he's fundamentally nice. He uh, just doesn't really. He seems like a real badass. I thought. It's no, bad. he's a badass. I'm just saying he I like he was angry. I he was angry. He wouldn't just kill you. He only kills people who challenge him. Okay, I will not. So I'm him. fine as long as I don't challenge him. Exactly. Yeah. Right. Like, That's right, Ock. All right. But so, does challenging him turn him on? That's another thing. <laughs> oh, I don't know. In the bedroom? I don't know. That's a good question. That's. Hey, so oh, we're we got that right now. You want to go Bonnie. first? We got Edgar, Bonnie McFarlane, and Akuma. Well, Who would you wed? Bed dead. I am definitely wedding the only female that's there. Oh, wedding Bonnie, huh? Uh, then yeah, um, and then I am going to uh, hmm, the other one. Looked kind of like a woman, so I guess I can uh, <laughs> get that one. <laughs> Bedger? Bedger? If I close my eyes and pretend, I can I can make it work. I can see and that. then I'm obviously killing that demon man well, because good, good yeah. luck. he looks he looks a lot like the other demon men that I have heard about. So mm. we can't have those. No, you don't want that around. He's seen some no. shit off once, so I, I I see where he's coming from. Interesting. That's yeah. a Vulgar language with that too. Yeah. Yeah. No <laughs> cursing in the auction house. Okay, sorry. Oh, or we in can't help it. It yeah. just happens. Yeah. You could say the N word, but not a curse. <laughs> <laughs> and star, 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 star. Right? Yeah. Calvin. Uh, oof, this is a bit difficult. Um, I would wed Edgar because he's rich 
He's like a prince. He's royal. He's got a lot of money. And he's an inventor. That's really cool. Mm. Um, we can, you know, sit around and invent things together, talk about, like, you know, creating Like, as stuff. if you could, like, help him. <laughs> like, you're not on his level. <laughs> well, well, that does sound sweet. It does. See? You can barely use your microwave. You don't have to. <laughs> Listen, I know he's a microwave. I just have not used my oven. But that's <laughs> fine. That's what Edgar's for. Yeah. You know? And then, like, you know, I can, like. What do you bring into the table? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Does he want I that? I bring scintillating conversation and wit. And As I, he's building something, you're gonna be like, bah, 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 waka waka. He's like, Guess, I gotta finish my crossbow. Get out of here. No, I mean, I help him like play test things. I'd be like, hey, this chainsaw doesn't have enough teeth on it. We should add more teeth. And he'd be like, okay, cool. Yeah, right, I got a plan. Let's That's what it says on Grinder. Scintillating conversation. <laughs> you don't know. I don't know. I don't <laughs> know. Not on there. I think that site spit once. Scintillating conversation. Have you looked for me on there? How do you know I'm not on there? <laughs> Anyway, so I'm going to wet Edgar. Um, I'll wet Edgar. I will... Mm, this is hard. Okay. It's not Akuma hard. looks like he won't take it. That's all I'm going to He gives. Yeah. I mean, that's okay. But, like, I, the thing is, it's difficult. But I think, ultimately, I would bet Akuma... That body, though. Stupid. Right? That body's stupid sick. Yeah, he's ripped. And yeah, on top of that... But he's got that, weird, like, uh, grayish skin. Come on, you into that? Well, I'll put, put on a blindfold. Calvin's but, fucked someone with gray skin before. Yeah, he probably <laughs> <laughs> Some old dusty coal miner or something. <laughs> <laughs> On a road gig in Virginia. <laughs> Philadelphia. That's not the point. <laughs> Calvin, <laughs> come back to the cave with me. <laughs> All right, sorry. <laughs> All right. But I did, well, because I also, you know, we, we could, you know, fool around then, like, in the rest of the night, I'd be like, hey, just teach me some moves. You're always like, <laughs> as if you're qualified to learn. <laughs> Again, I can fight. <laughs> no, you can play fighting games very well. I can play fighting games very well. I can. I grew up in Flatbush. I know how to fight. You got the fights? I see this becoming... I mean, <laughs> it was in a fight <laughs> that I won. I won. Okay, well, I won one fight, too. In my what, was, what was her name? <laughs> oh. oh. Ding, 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 ding. Bam! Ooh, the bell. So you're gonna kill? Uh, I mean, I'm unfortunately gonna have to kill Biden. Wow! It's unfortunate, wow. and I really don't want to. I really don't. You but hate I, Americans, no. huh? So hate women. <laughs> the heartland. No. Biden doesn't bring enough. Well, I'm not gonna wrangle cattle, ladies. He's not an ally. Look, no. <laughs> I, I respect her right to you know be her own rancher. Oh, but thanks. Like, I don't. She, she, women can be ranchers too. Yeah. Thanks, Calvin. Jeez. <laughs> It's, that's well, very progressive. I, I, I do the, see this becoming a story about learning how to fight into something lovable. <laughs> 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 All right. Such a nice guy, Al Kwan. Yeah. See, I, I try. Like you want to go next? Nice. Right. Uh, man, these are tough ones. Edgar, Bonnie, Akuma. Akuma, Matata. I think I'm, I'm going to have to go s- similar to Calvin. I'm oh. going to have to marry Edgar. Yep. For different reasons. Typical though. gold digger. For different digger. reasons. I'm a gold digger. Yeah, he is. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't messing with no broke dandies. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so it means a lot of advantage. He's an inventor. I love science, right? So I'd be like, "Oh, what are you working on? Cool." And I'm, you know, just like, I'm not gonna chime in and be like, "Hey, why don't you do right. it this way?" You know, yeah. but I'll just be like a supportive wife or whatever. Calvin's uh, like, like the annoying. And he's super assistant. well. He's super well dressed. So like, I can probably up my my clothing game. You like that though? Would you walk around? Fancy would you attire? walk around in a waistcoat? I, I would be like somewhere between where I am now tights? and where he's at. So you like tights. I dress better, but not as much as him. But I'd so be you'd like, basically be dressing like a hipster. Whatever, I've he's rich. Them. I could figure it out, right? He, he has <laughs> access to tailors and stuff like that. Uh, he makes his own clothes. Yeah, and then he could make cool gadgets for me. You know what I mean? Like, like what? Like scissors? <laughs> like automatic scissors? <laughs> you know, maybe like uh, like uh, like uh, shoes that turn into roller skates, like wheelies, but like better versions of wheelies uh, and stuff like that. I'm starting <laughs> to feel like I have to kill Edgar now. <laughs> change that. He's going to put me out of business. <laughs> <laughs> he might. He, he might. starts selling this stuff and I'm in trouble. <laughs> roller shoes? <laughs> I'll be like, I need a new wallet chain or whatever, you know, and he'll just make me. I one. love how outside the box you're thinking. <laughs> I know. And then okay. I'm just marrying a rich person and still for thinking wallet, poor. <laughs> for a wallet chain. Can you make me a belt buckle? That would be really nice. Uh, listen, I, <laughs> my spoon broke for my cereal. Can I get a new spoon? I have a super poor mentality. I never buy shit in video games because I'm like, oh, I'm not going to pay 400 gold for a sword. Get the fuck out of here. I'll I, find I, it out in the wilderness. I know. I listen. I literally, I'll, you can literally just fight. If you don't buy it, money. someone else will. Yes. <laughs> I literally. I'm not even joking with you. I never ever buy this shit in any video game. What about I'm like, weapons? It's too expensive. I'm not buying that. <laughs> That's awesome. What about weapons? So you just I'll just go find it. I just like, go grind out and find it. That's what uh, happens in, in this world. People fight things and they get weapons. It's amazing. Yes. Yeah. So. I literally cannot even think of one time where I've like, unless I'm really struggling to play the game, I will never buy it. Like God of War. Wait, I was gonna say yeah. God of War. Do you, well, no, do those are upgrades, so you have to okay. buy them. Yeah. <laughs> 
Because you can't. I mean, you can't. You can't upgrade. No, you could buy it's different than like he wouldn't uh, like. But so, you can still buy original weapons. So if the Blades of Chaos were in a store, you wouldn't buy them. Yeah, you'd be like, I'll just find them. Somewhere. Yeah, just find them somewhere. <laughs> I, I can get them for you cheaper. <laughs> like, if I have an iron sword, I'm not going to buy a brown sword. I'm going to wait to get a brown all right, sword. All right. A brown sword. Sure. Get a platinum sword with a dragon on it. Ooh, yeah. that, but that, I don't, I'm not going to pay you 40000 whatever gold for, you know. You can ask your new husband for, for a loan. Yeah. Uh, okay, anyway, so that's good. Uh, right. Wedding Edgar. Uh, I'm going to have to bed uh, Bonnie, you know, beautiful, sexy rancher's daughter. You're going to have to do that? She's she's all right. She's shy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Well, she, she did dick. have a gun in that picture, so... Yeah, I'm yeah. fine with that, you know? A gunplay, right, Calvin? Gun play, we just, talked about gunplay. You, you don't need to use it just because she has it. Of course you do. <laughs> if it's accessible, might as well. And then I'm going to have to kill Akuma because he, he's <sighs> probably definitely an evil guy. I don't believe you. He's, he's not he's, evil. He's pretty evil. He's not evil. He's just passionate about fighting. <laughs> That's evil. I right? don't need a violent person like that in my yeah, life. He's like a UFC freak. Like, yeah. I just love fighting. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it would be, like, be like dating Joe Jonas. You don't want to date Joe Jonas? No, I don't want to date Joe Jonas. For the Jonas Brothers? Isn't that his name Joe Jonas? Joe Jones? Joe John. John, John, John Jones? Jones? John Jones, idiot. <laughs> what the? They're a little different. <laughs> Whatever. Same oh difference. My goodness. All right. <sighs> Joe Jonas. <laughs> The thing with the inventions is 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 very tempting because it would be cool to be like, like I just got a, my lights to be controlled by my Google Home, so I just got to say turn my lights on and they do. I think it's amazing. So if I needed some, hey Edgar, can you just make this? We need something to. He'd be like, yeah, I got you. Tinker, tinker, tinker. He probably already had that. Yeah, he may already have. Or he doesn't need or, Google for that. Or he'll just make it, which is like yeah. that's why I think it's really cool. So I think I will have to wed him as well. Okay. Um, <laughs> that was keeping score. <laughs> um, <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it seems. Uh, yeah, I mean, it, would, it would be too much to have a night with Akuma. No, it wouldn't. It would be scary. He's It'd be passionate. He's on fire, dude. But only sometimes. And then you know that raging demon sex. I'm just saying. Yeah, I don't need yeah. raging demon sex. I'm a 38 year old boring white man. <laughs> the other question. The other question is: What's a missionary the in the, the dark? Yeah. <laughs> does the carpet match the drapes? That's the other question. Yeah, is that a, you fi- if it's a fire, fire dick? No. No, no, just a fire crotch. The dick would just be brown. Because it's singed? Gray. It'll be gray. It depends. Is it flaccid or no? Because that, yeah. Oh, that's really true. Because what if it rages? It. If yeah. he starts super... Uh, you, you know, he's dead. I'm, I'm killing him. <laughs> I'm killing him. I'm taking my one-night stand Bonnie's shotgun and hopefully killing Akuma with him. I'm going to bed Bonnie But I mean, once. hey, but he's got the fist too. Dra- no, Dra- th- good, choices. good choices. Oh, good that choices sounds great. Yeah. I mean, I'm just saying, right? I'm done. No. Betting, <laughs> betting Bonnie. I do not want that fist anywhere near me. <laughs> and then I'll ride off into the sunset on her horse that I steal. From the ranch, so that's what I'll do. But why not a crystal dragon? Oh, see, yeah. great point. I, have I like your upsell. That'd be like great. There, <laughs> that's a good. So yeah, uh, Aquan, this has been this is a good one. Yes, eye opening. It's been great. Thank it's you so much for day. teaching us the ways and learning all about your lifestyle and everything. And uh, it's been awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Thank and you for having me. Back to the realm. Uh, yes, maybe Blizzard. Hopefully, Blizzard doesn't notice I'm gone for too long. Please, <laughs> oh, yeah. please unionize. <laughs> Just wrong what they're doing to you. I'll yeah. try to. I'll talk to uh, auctioneer. Yeah, talk to the blacksmiths. NC. Talk to the yeah. Guys. Both auctioneers yeah. should probably get together. Yeah. Maybe go on strike. I don't the know. The guards, you know. Yeah, see what happens. So we'll talk next Tuesday. Stormwind Local One Hundred One. All right. Thank you guys for listening and have a great rest of your week. We'll see you at the Long Island Retro Expo on the eleventh. Yay! Give me your fingernails. <laughs> Steve Esposito. Please check out his podcast, Copper Piece Podcast. It is a D&D adventure podcast. Please check it out. It comes out every... Every Thursday. We went from Tuesday to Thursday. Okay. Look at that. Change it up from a T to another T. You'll also catch him at the Long Island Retro Expo. He will have a table and you should go and check it out. Thank you. (laughs) 